Hello everyone, this is Brooke and welcome back to my channel. Today I'd like to do a quick outfit of the day video for you that was sort of requested by a friend of mine on YouTube named DDG LA Diva. Recently I put a pair of shoes on Instagram and she requested that I do an outfit of the day video with those shoes. And so I designed a look today that I call simply, you know, a girl's night out look or something I would wear typically for a night out, a casual but yet you want to be fabulous. So that's what I have on today. I'll show you the outfit. I'll start off with my makeup and accessories, and then I'll go outside and let you see the whole thing put together. So starting with makeup, I went simple but bold. I am wearing very little makeup, but I have it on in, I would say, a lot quantity. So as far as eyes go, I just have on black eyeliner, and you can see I put it on really thickly and winged it out a little bit, and I have um, my eyebrows filled in, and a little bit of mascara. Um, the colors I'm wearing are bold, and my hair is very dark, so it's creating a very high contrast look. So when I was doing my makeup, I wanted a very high contrast, uh, meaning darker eyebrows, darker eyes, and bold lips to kind of balance the color and the brightness of the jacket. So that was what was going through my mind when I was putting this together. So the eyes are bold but simple and as far as lips go I am wearing Max Rebel which looks like this. It's much darker in the stick. Um, it looks like there's a good swatch of it right there. It turns out to be a, a very bright berry look on the lips and I'm also wearing Max Rebel Lip Glass, which is the matching color for it, and um, there they are side by side. I put the lip glass in the center of my lip on the bottom to kind of add to fullness. So that's what I'm doing as far as the lips go. And then for my blush, I am doing something different today. You know I love my Plum Foolery by MAC, but today I went for really bold color that I had in my collection. It's called Full Fuchsia, and it looks like this. You see it really blends in with the jacket color and I think it pulls out the cheek color. Um, I didn't want to have my face washing away with the brightness of the jacket. So I thought this color would be really good for um, accentuating my features and being in harmony with the color of my jacket. So that is Full Fuchsia by MAC. It's very bright, very bold. You put it on with a light hand and layer it to the intensity that you want. And that's what I did. Um, as far as accessories go, I am wearing um, a pair of spiked earrings. Um, with, you see they're silver with a really long spike. And I also have on my silver studs. Um, I have on no necklace because I thought the earrings were enough to take care of this whole area. And the thing you hear jingling around all the time is this spiked bracelet I'm wearing. It's from Charming Charlie's, but it's silver and it's featuring long spikes on a stretch cord. And I think it's really nice. goes with this outfit. And this bracelet right here is a stud bracelet that I got from Aldo's. I have the matching bracelet on this wrist and it's just balancing off my Tritone watch by Michael Kors and this, you know, you see this every time, the silver bracelet that I wear that I made. Um, so that's what I have on as far as my wrists go. Uh, for other accessories, I am wearing um, my Louis Vuitton Flory Cat Eye Sunglasses and I'm also using my Louis Vuitton pochette, Lexington pochette, in the fuchsia pink color. I did another video about this. I'll link it below if you want to see a review on this pochette, but it's really cute, and I think it's um, blending in well with all my hot pink, and it's, it's dainty, perfect for a girl's night out. And then as far as shoes, like I said, I designed this outfit based on the shoes, and this is what they look like. Wow. They are a hot pink pair of stiletto booties. You see it's a pink sole with a pink heel and a hidden kind of platform in there and um, it's got like a pink patent a really shiny look that goes around the bottom and then it's a peep toe shows off the toes and it also has a ruffle to it. 
three ruffle layers and a zip back. It's got a faux suede material, which doesn't bother me in the spring. I think it still works because of the peep toe and the thinness of the heel makes it seem more airy. So I definitely am rocking this this time of the year in spring. And you know, I think these are fabulous. Just want to warn you, I'm using a new camera and this camera is not giving you the full effect of the brightness of this shoe or my jacket. They are very hot pink and I think you'll see it better when I go out in the sunlight. But this is the shoe that the whole look is designed around. On top I'm wearing a hot pink full leather motorcycle jacket. Um, you'll see it better outside. Underneath I'm just wearing a plain t-shirt that's in white. It's got a low v-neck and it's from Wet Seal. Oh, the jacket, by the way, is from Kohl's. It's a Candies brand. I got it in the fall, so I don't know if they still have it, but it was something that just jumped off the shelf and grabbed me when I saw it. Because hot pink and motorcycle jacket, I've never seen such a combination, and I'm so happy I found it. And then as far as bottoms, I'm just wearing a pair of skinny jeans. They're distressed. You'll see that they have like a little rip kind of, you know, in them that, you know, distressed look. I didn't put the hole in there, it came that way. But um, they're skinny jeans, basic blue, they are Refuge brand, and I got them from Charlotte Russe several years ago. Yay, I can still fit them. And um, the shoes are on the bottom. So that's pretty much the whole outfit. What I'll do right now is stand back and let you take a look at it. Have a nice day. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.